Ready, ready, like we talked about before. But there's still a chance if they get the poison attack plus the Jinada slow on him, they might, he might still die. I am oh, going to yeah. with the slow, the damage for Shiki as well. They should be able to bring this one down and they will indeed be a TP in from Faith. He will be able to find the return kill onto the bounty hunter just in time as the tower hit. More or less. Oh, let's see if they can go for this one. Shiki still got a haste for at the moment. Yeah, this is going to be a hard one. They are going to find the telekinesis and maybe not. He's got four points in the corrosive skin. He's actually going to be a... No, he's not. There we go. Laguna Blade does finish him off burning. There's your shuriken. Finally skilled up as bounty hits level four. He finds a return kill on Selena, but it's a two for one so far as he loses his own life. Lightning Storm, slow coming through Ferrari there with a the final bottle charge. Able to keep himself alive. Will get out. Truck first on the Viper. Here we go, going forward here, they want to go right round to the Viper, Fish is going to miss, in fact, but the Decrepit Fight, the Laguna Blade, the Magical Burst, bring down the Viper, but now, very nice split up onto three, and the Winter Wife in there as well, with the old, holding them in place, they've actually found three kills, aggressive running up to the high ground, just as they're feeding himself a kill to Ferrari there. In a good spot here. Indeed, there's a bit of smoke on smoke action here. IG trying That's to pay it. here with the Pugna. Shiki leaning up to the high ground. Faith is going to find a Fisher on to four there. Echo Slam coming out as well. Trying to find out a Viper side of Sonic. But oh, oh, here with the wall drop onto IG. IG, they're in a lot of trouble. They've lost two. They might be able to get Faith as well. They will do. It's going to be three arrows down on the side of IG. Ferrari trying to fight up here. Gets the record with out. Shiki getting very low. It's a free for one trade so far. Guard who's under the sentry ward. For IG just turns around with a few right click. They will take him down. It's a double kill here for Lua on the Pugna. He's not going to be able to go for it. He's going to have to come back and help his team potentially because the Laguna Blade's been dropped onto the Dark Sea. And there we go. Pogna will be able to drain him down here. Looks like C Deck want to turn this around though. They've been able to bring down the Rubik. And they're going to see Pogna getting low as well. But he's turning around as Less Track. It's not enough to sucky sucky there with the Life Train as he goes down as a two for two. Faith's in a lot of trouble as well. He's trying to do what he can as the mech from 430. Maybe they can turn this around. But no, the Winter's Curse onto Burning. Now Ferrari starts to hit away at Lina. Lina's getting low. Lina will be able to back up Faith. Only just keeping himself alive there. They're trying to burst down the Winter Wife and his not enough. And again, that's all they needed to have the confidence to fight for this one. XC surging himself forward, seeing what he can find here. He's got the wall available. He's going to find Earthshaker. Earthshaker blinks away. There's three of them in the sidelines. The ward has been dropped. See, they're going to try and fight into this one. Here we go. Aggressive pop the BKB. But they've already lost the Darks here. They will be able to bring down Faith. But look, Aggressive with the BKB. He's getting so low. He's trying to do what he can here with the split up. But the right clicks from 430. They're too much. Sheriff is going to be able to find that kill. Now he the Rec Room. He's going to clip both the Viper and the Wyvern on the side of this one. Burning does fall for the side of IG. But now Ferrari turns his attention towards Shiki here on the Viper. Trying to burst him down. And they are going to be able to keep him alive a little bit with the uh, Wyvern's help, but it's not going to be enough. They've lost the fight, but they will lose the Wyvern. Double kill here for 430. And now Garda, he's got to be left alone in this fight. Chuan's still very low. The life strain, the boosted the <laughs> length of it, catching out the bounty hunter. Not enough to bring him out. We're actually just going to see the puck in the top. Chuan back up so the bounty hunter can't pick anyone off off the back of that. Okay. Oh, and IG are right on them. This isn't really the time to smoke. Bajiki will be able to get the BKB out. Ferrari on the front lines here. Trying to go in with the right clicks. Now it's to back up as the Viper Strike comes out. BKB being popped by both sides here. Turns around with the right click. Punches on aggressive. Bring him below. The mech's being popped by Viper. That will be enough to keep aggressive alive. The life drain on TXC. Now your Echo Souls catch them out. Aggressive has been held back in this fight. Faithy's still got the Echo Slam available. Trying to walk himself in. There's your Echo Slam. And now Tron coming in on the Rubik. Being able to lift them up. Control them. They go out to Shiki as well here with the right clicks from the Scar. He's slowed him down. He'll go down. There's a buyback from the Wyvern. Q with the Winter's Curse now to burn. Helping Ferrari bring him down, but the decrepify there from Luo from the low ground, ensuring that the right clicks from the Shadow Fiend don't go front to burning. IG, they're keeping this fight going. Glimmer came on to Q. Is it actually going to be enough here? He tries to turn around here with a splinter blast, but it bounces to no one. And now with the Yules onto the Leshrak, holding him back. Aggressive, trying to chase this down with the right clicks. Ferrari getting very, very low. Does manage to get himself a dive, but now the life straight onto the Leshrak. Luo finds himself another kill. Garner trying to go for Luo, but now with the BKB pod, he's just going to simply TP himself out of there. They've got nothing to stop it. He After that fight, it's like IG. There. Oh, oh, that's a nice fat human wall coming down here from the side of C deck. And aggressive though, he's getting looked at Ferrari 430. He's just standing his ground and fighting for it. Lua here in the pit, trying to do what he can as well. They've already lost two here on the side of IG. Can C deck turn this one around even more? Ferrari now with the rec room on to free. This side of C deck, they're trying to go for Lua here on the poker. But he's still alive with the life drain. It's not going to be enough, but it's a mega kill streak for 430. Make that a double kill. Now he's looking for Garda here as well. He'll take down the losers from the wall. And now he might even be able to find Wyvern as well with Trance setting that. Up. The final race is a triple kill. It's an ultra kill there as he dies, and the Requiem brings down the bounty hunter. Go back up to the high ground for round two, and, and the racks now exposed. Bell's been dropped onto Ferrari. Oh, the cheeky four stuff again. Catching out the Viper, but now with the BKB pop by Ferrari, he's opting to pop it now. And now oh. with the Red Crip, but now the Winter's Curse holding him in place. And they, whoa, they can't bring him down. They will now bring him down, but now he's got the Aegis. He's ready for round two. Viper goes down, does buyback straight away. Lua keeping this um, Leshrac right back here with the life drain. 
And the damage here is too much for these racks to stand up to. Range traps will almost certainly fall and try and go forward here with the lift onto Q. They'll be able to life drain him down. The Lotus Orb came out, but it's a little bit too late. Life drain had already been casted and begun. Aggressive trying to send this one down, but now BKB popped by Lou. He's trying to go in here with the Drefi and the life drain onto the left track. It's so much damage. The wall comes out, but it's not enough. Oh, was that Trans Wall? I, I'm not quite sure what's going on. Yeah, yes, it was. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. It was Trans Wall, that fight. And now they'll lose Shiki as well. It's going to be a double kill here for Luo, but the Pugna picks that one up. He's going to be able to heal up Faith. They will be able to clean up the mid racks. And GG is called IG break the base, and they break down the team. Winter, it's, it, it looked good for C-Deck in the mid game, but it just felt like they were making too many mistakes there towards the end.